All right, monster truck fans, here we go drawing Gravedigger. Gravedigger is pretty much gonna take up your whole page, but what we wanna do is we wanna start right about here in the middle of the page. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna go draw a straight line about this wide, right in the middle of the page. This is gonna be the underbelly of the truck. So right here, we're gonna go into the front wheel well. So we're gonna do a nice little curve up, and towards the front, it's gonna be a little more straight down. So kind of arc it up like this. And towards the front of that wheel well, we're gonna go ahead and curve it down just a little bit. Kind of being like a little bit of a style right there. <clears throat> what we're gonna do next is we're gonna draw the, the fender. So we're gonna follow this line, kind of giving it a little bit of thickness towards the front. So we're gonna go up, kind of going up like this. Perfect, and then we're gonna close that off. Nice. So this same style of wheel well we're going to do in the back. So we're going to curve up like this and then follow that line all the way to the, toward the, the back bumper wheel. Nice. Now from here, we're going to draw the back side of the truck. It's kind of going to be like, let's do a little curve first. And then again, we're going to do this same type of curve, but it's almost going to be like a step up. So curve and down like that. Nice. So the top of this truck is going to go all the way to the front windshield to about right, maybe right there. So let's go ahead and make a kind of a straight line, but it's almost like it curves upward just a, just a smidge. Perfect. So from there, we're going to draw the front windshield down to about right here. Awesome. All right, from this line, we're gonna take this down to the hood. It's gonna go out and have that same style of curve like that. So going down just a smidge. And then that front has that little old timey curve. Perfect. So now this window, about maybe a little bit back, we're gonna do a line straight down. This is a driver's side window. So we're gonna make a line straight across the top. Follow this line down at an angle. Nice. And then close that line straight across the bottom. Perfect. So now that we have the body down, what I like to do is grab a pencil because it's kind of hard to draw circles with a, with a Sharpie. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna draw two wheels about this size. So get your pen and kind of hold it nice and light. And what you wanna do is kind of give yourself just a guideline of where the circle should be. So just kind of do a light, a light circle, kind of adjusting it to the size you want. Gives you a good guideline so that you don't you don't lay down a line too too solid right away. So do the same on both sides. Kind of give yourself a rough idea of where you want your wheels to be. Nice. So I think those look pretty good. And what I'm going to do is I'm now I'm going to go over it with the sharpie. lines, one circle on each side. It's not perfect, but at least it gives us a better idea of, of what a round circle would be. It'd be a lot harder to do straight without a guideline. Perfect. So once we have our sharper laid down, grab your uh, trusty gigantic marker or eraser and erase the pencil line so we don't see it. Perfect. So now we have our wheels. What we're going to do next is we're going to draw our, our shocks. So we, these big monster trucks have tons of shocks going every direction. So let's draw two parallel lines coming from the middle of the body going that way. So one there, and one there. Awesome. So two more going this way. One, two. Perfect. Now we're going to have double shocks coming up through here. So let's do like a long rectangle. One there there. Perfect. So let's do two thinner lines going up from there to connect to the body. One, two. One, two. Perfect. So same thing here. We're going to do two long rectangles first. One, 
two, and then go ahead and do two thin lines going up into the body. It's got a nice little, little action there. Okay, so for the center of these circles, let's do one more circle in the middle, in the middle to be the hubcap. Perfect. Now, I was trying to draw monster truck wheels for a while, and I figured out this trick. So if you think of a clock, 12, 6, 3, and 9, so you just draw a little U, like that. Not quite touching the edge, so do 12, and then do 6, just like that. And then do 3 o'clock, 9 o'clock, perfect. And then we're going to do 2 in the middle of each one. not a perfect way to do it, but it's kind of, I found it to be a little bit easier than trying to draw those treads all at the same time. So once you have all your U's, what we're going to do is we're going to draw lines going that way. So that'll be kind of like our tread. All that, all the way around. Perfect. So it's not perfect, but it, it kind of gives the same look as the tire. Do the same thing on this side. 12 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 9 o'clock, and then 2 in between each one. So Grave Digger has a little moon here that has a haunted house in it. So let's go ahead and draw a circle right here under the window. So there's your window. And right here on this side, there's like a zombie coming out from underneath the ground. So let's draw two skull eyes. They're almost like circles, but they're kind of more like, like eye sockets. So they're a little bit, not quite um, round. So one there one there and you know a, a skeleton's eye is like a almost like an upward arrow so like that. perfect now on this line we're going to kind of do a little squiggly and then back here we're going to do four tombstones so coming through here kind of do it squigglies and then right about here let's do a, a square tombstone we'll do another tombstone with kind of a little funky top and then this one, let's just do a regular old curved tombstone, and then maybe another, another rectangle tombstone. Perfect! So next, on the front here, you know, uh, Grave Digger has all these flames, so we're going to do a curvy lines like that. So let's do one, and then the next one will start from the top, and then we'll meet that one. Awesome. So from here, we'll start here, and we'll go up and over. So up and over. And maybe curve it down one more time. Perfect. And then we'll draw like a little U right there. Close that off. And maybe one more flame sticking out there. Awesome. There's Grave Digger. Let's color.